Giles with it. Throws it down the line. It's there. Burley are back in the Premier League. Fantastic from the Clarence. They've won here by two goals to one. Mass celebrations out in the middle. What an achievement. Well done to Vincent Kamini's staff. What a massive achievement. Unbeaten since November. Most wins in the division. The least defeats. Most goals. The best defence in the division. Burnley are up on merit. The first promotion in the top five tiers in English football. What an achievement for Vincent Company. Willie, what a what a year oh, it's been. I'm, I'm delighted for them because they play the football the proper way. With passion, honesty and great skill. And Nathan Teller is leading the celebrations across to that far corner where the Burnley fans have made the journey to the Riverside. Burnley are up. Fantastic achievement. They're back in the Premier League. Only a year away. Well done to Alan Pace and his board. What a transformation. Yeah. Big stars left last summer. They've supported Vincent Cumney in the market to provide a young, vibrant, ambitious side that has taken the league by absolute storm. And it's their moment and they're celebrating with the Burnley fans. Vincent Company's going over there. It's a fantastic moment for the team, isn't it? Fantastic, to, to achieve fantastic achievement. Straight down, straight up. We're playing good football. I mean, there are 11 points clear of Sheffield United. And it's Connor Roberts that's on the shoulders of Jack Cork. He's got the winner. And that's typical Vincent Company, isn't it? That the right back in the six yard box has got the winner. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they were brilliant. Really pleased for them. It's all smiles, isn't it? It's all smiles. I mean, he talked about a two, three year project. Yeah. Where are you from, Phil? I'm from Burnley. I'm from Burnley, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, was born, I was born in the town. Lived away at times. Yeah, they're good know, people. They are. They're, they're fantastic. It's yeah. a down to earth yeah. town. Yeah. You know, and Vincent Company's come and he's really, really embraced it. Fantastic recruitment, you know, last summer. Yeah. Brought in some fantastic players. Yeah. And you picked out the centre backs today, didn't you? Yeah. They did well. Alder, yeah. Keel, and Bear. Very well. Yeah, great on the ball. If you're strong down the middle, get good goalkeeper, two central defenders. Cullen in midfield was outstanding. Yeah. And then Bams up front, holds it up, brings people into the game. Yeah, they've got and the wide the wide players up front were both very good. Worked hard for the team as well. Yeah, it's on it's on merit, you know. Fantastic. You know how they've done this season. And that is their 11th league away win of the season. They've well, gone to, you know, they've gone to places and won games. And test. this is a tough test today. It's a test of character away from home. Yeah. You know. A full house here, wasn't it? You yeah, know. Oh yeah. You know, Middlesbrough still had hopes of finishing second, and they've come to Middlesbrough and they've won the game, taken yeah. it to them. And the fans, the fans have been tremendous. Look at them. And Ashley Barnes just been interviewed now. A word about Ashley Barnes. He's the second Burnley player to win three promotions to the top flight. Michael oh. Duff was the first. Oh. He's, I mean, he's done it three times. He's just an honest player. Honest player. Got a great vital goal. Yeah, it was a great goal. It was an opportunist goal, wasn't it? No, it's, it, look, it looks easy, but unless you play at that level, yeah. it's a very, very good goal. Yeah, he's full of smiles, Ashley Barnes, just speaking to Sky. You know, he'll know how big it is. He'll know how difficult a task it is to come back it's massive. straight away. But the Championship is a really, really hard league. Really hard league. To win it like this is a ma massive achievement. It's a runaway win, isn't it? 11 yeah. points clear of Sheffield United, 19 clear of Luton, now 20 clear of Middlesbrough. And, and as we keep saying, they've done it in a classy way. Yeah. With good football, yeah. it's not about grinding out results. They've won games. Yes, yeah, on the front with foot. With skill. Yeah, the front foot. I mean, that's a typical Vincent Company goal. For Connor Roberts to pop up in the six yard box and finish the move off. Yeah. That is so Vincent yeah, yeah, Company. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, <laughs> I don't like to say it, but it's Man City. Yes, it is a little. Yeah, in, in, in the championship. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it, 
you the see, same, it's the same principle. It is, yeah. You trying see, to play with You see the City fullbacks getting forward yeah, yeah, a lot, yeah. don't you? And Burnley have done and that. People getting in the box, yes. getting in the six yard yeah, box. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Sterling, before he went to City, hardly scored a goal. Yeah, well, And then when he started getting to the back post, yeah. he yeah. scored for fun. Yeah. And now, Burnley have got to keep hold of Vincent Company, haven't they? <laughs> If they can, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know that's the $64,000 question. Yeah. But you know, there's a little project here, isn't there? He's yeah, got yeah. Burnley back up. No, no. The next task will be to keep Burnley yeah, in the yeah, Premier yeah. League. Yeah, yeah. He's clearly a top, young, yeah. ambitious man. Well, he's got to be given some money. Yes, oh. yeah. I think they backed him last summer, to be fair to the chairman. Players went out and he was able to bring in yeah. players. I think he'll be able to bring in players again. He's just taking that in, isn't he, Vincent Cumberland? see him on the camera yeah. he's yeah. loving every minute of enjoying it enjoying it you know when he came in June players were going out the door as quickly as players were coming in you know it was incredible oh, oh yeah you know turnaround oh yeah and to bring in oh, he yeah. brought in 16 no, players no, last no, summer nobody could believe what's happened yeah. you, know, you, you can't turn <laughs> get ready and bring in so many players and be successful like that yeah that quick yeah it's unheard of yeah and he's done it hasn't he there hasn't been a bad signing i said that team commentary i don't think there's been a bad signing yeah. and they're celebrating now on that far side and it's great to do that yeah. in front of the fans yeah. isn't it yeah yeah who've been magnificent this year. you remember the burnley fans in your day they yeah. were always vocal and oh. they've traveled up and no, down the country no, they're fanatical. to follow them this season they're fanatical Look, little Ash Hoskins is in there. He will be. He, he, played, he, will for, be. he played for Burnley. Yeah, yeah, supports the club. Yeah, yeah. He, yeah, he, he travels everywhere. He, he'll be, we might not see him for a few days, will he? But Probably you know, not. he'll be in there. <laughs> he'll be in there and he'll be celebrating tonight. <laughs> I mean, it's great to get it done, isn't it? Yeah. You it's know, tremendous. There's, there's, you know, so many games to go. Uh, he says hastily checking his notes seven games to go and it's amazing as well really the size of Burnley the town yeah yeah for them to be in the Premier League yeah it's yeah. massive yeah four promotions in 15 years you know when you compare them to like the big big six yeah it's a different world it, it, is a, it is a different world and it will get tough next season but it's all about the moment isn't it yeah um, I mean, everybody was superb mm. tonight. They had to ride the storm when Middlesbrough got the penalty. We thought it was a little contentious. Never but, but, you know, at 1-1, you could argue the momentum was yeah. with Middlesbrough. It showed, it showed great character. Because Middlesbrough, they gave them a lift yeah. for five or ten minutes. But then Burnley came again. Yeah. Took control of the game. Yeah. And thoroughly deserved to win. And all those goals this season, 19 for Nathan Teller. And he's the provider. Yeah. On the big day, the deciding yeah. day, yeah, isn't yeah, it? It was a great was ball, wasn't I was it? I was impressed with him. Yes. Positive. Difficult not to be impressed mm. with everybody in a Burnley show. Well, and, and his work rate defensively. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it, I don't want to pick on people, but the other night, Newcastle and Man United. Yeah. Trippier is bombing forward. Great player. Yeah. They're overlapping. Yeah. And then the, the United forwards were, were nowhere to be seen. Yes. Whereas yeah, you don't, yeah. you didn't see uh, Middlesbrough fullbacks bombing on. No, no, we're not no, going with them. No, some fantastic scenes over in that corner, isn't it? I mean, you've had some success in your, in your time playing and coaching. You've got to make the most of these moments. Haven't yeah, you? absolutely. Uh, what came to mind before Phil was Bob Paisley when they first won the European Cup. Yeah, yeah. They, they said to him, "Oh, you're going to go and have a few drinks." He said, no, I want to have a drink. I'm just going to really enjoy, savour this moment. Yes, yeah. He said, surely you'll have a glass of champagne. He said, no, I'm going to just enjoy, enjoy it, this. Enjoy it, yeah. And they've all stayed behind in that corner. It's fantastic noise. Burnley are back in the Premier League. And just look at Ashley Barnes there, just milking it in. Yeah. Just acknowledging the support. Yeah. Just enjoying it. Alan Pace, yeah. the chairman, is there. How well has he done with his board to support Vincent Company in the market? Well, I'm really happy to be here on this night. Yeah, it's great to see you, Will. It's fantastic to see you. Some great memories from your playing career. Notice we didn't mention the World Cup in 78. <laughs> <laughs> great Scotland side. 
It was. It was a great Scotland side. And Burnley just celebrating now in front of those fans. Yeah. Um, I mean, what can they do now? What's the target now? Clearly win the title. 100 points, is that, is that the target? Uh, Phil, it doesn't really matter. I mean, that would be nice. That's just yeah. icing on the cake. Surely they'll win the title. They're 11 clear of Sheffield United. Yeah, yeah. They're going to win the title, aren't they? Definitely. And they deserve and, and, to. And now they can relax. Yeah, yeah. Again, yeah. I remember the first time United won the, the Premier League. And then... Um, they won it on the Saturday, and I know the whole team went out and got drunk. Yeah. And yeah. they played the last game on the Monday. Yeah. And they were superb. Yeah. And they yeah. could just play with Burnley freedom. be good. Burnley be good on Monday. Yeah. You know they'll be focused. They'll enjoy it. Yeah. They're they, loving to see the fans there. There's no pressure on them now. They can go and enjoy it. Imagine turf more on Monday when they come out. <laughs> That'll be fantastic. Won't yeah. It? Yeah. The hairs on the back yeah. of the neck time, yeah, yeah. I think, won't it? Oh yeah. At turf more. Yeah. Uh, some great noise, some I'm great pleased, noise. I'm pleased for the fans. You know, it started in July, it was the earliest start ever to an English football league it's a very, it's because a very, of the World Cup. It's a very hard league. And, and you, you know, they've taken it by storm. And when you think of the teams in it, like Sheffield United and stuff, yeah. big clubs. Yeah. yeah. It's 19 unbeaten. They were beaten at Sheffield United, as you'll know, 5 so, 2. So and it was, you know, it was a bad yeah. day. It was a bad day, but since then, mm. there's been no doubt. Well, look at Middlesbrough, Sunderland, the size of them, you know. Yeah, big, big cities. A lot of big clubs. Big, big cities, aren't they? And Burnley have, 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 won, have won the league, but well, they've won promotion at the counter. Yeah, yeah. And I think they'll win the league comfortably. You know, it has to be the way, doesn't it? It has to be the way. They deserve it to be the way. It's just a fantastic achievement. I mean, Vincent Company will speak to the press tonight and he'll be so, so proud. It's 21 wins in the last 27 wow. championship games. Wow. I mean, you're bound to go away from sides if you're winning 21 yeah. out of 27, it's aren't amazing. you? I mean, it's tough next season, isn't it? But Burnley have got to build again. Bring yeah. in players yeah, yeah. And, and get ready for the uh, yeah. for the big division. Yeah. I mean, surely it's an advantage. You're going up seventh of April. You're going up on the seventh. You're going up on Good Friday. Yeah, yeah. You know, whereas the playoffs, the end of May, is that seven weeks? Seven weeks difference. Oh, no. It's got to be an advantage going up earlier. Massive, and it gives them time now to consolidate, review what's going on. Yeah. See what they need. Now, now it's recruitment again. It is. The long players are key, aren't and they? We talked about Bayer, didn't we? we you've, got to, you've got to keep the good ones. You have. And build you, on that. Yeah, Bayer, Matson, uh, Teller, of course, Arwood Bellis have been four big players, all on loan. But they've got to look to try and make those deals permanent, haven't they? It's Colin. Cullen's full time, yeah, he's, he's joined us from Anderlecht. Uh, so Cullen's. Uh, you player. like Cullen, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, like I said, he's the engineer, isn't he? He's the, well, he's the he was under pressure. They had four in midfield yeah. at times against him, and yeah, he still wanted he, to take the ball and yeah. the courage to take the ball. He's, he's a proper footballer, and isn't he? He's a, he's a West Ham type footballer. Yeah, yeah. That's what surprised me that it didn't happen for him at West Ham. It's well, all smiles. It's all smiles. Well, West, West Ham don't play as open as Burnley. No, you know. No, no. Johan Berg Gudmundsen is leading the Icelandic chant. You remember this from Euro 2016. <laughs> and Johan Berg Gudmundsen is leading the Icelandic chant. Yeah. All the Werner lads are joining in. All the fans are joining in. Yeah. Nobody wants to leave, do they? They just don't want to leave. It's such a big moment for everybody. We're going to leave it at that, Willie. It's been great to see you. No, I love really that. great to Thank see you. I remember you so well at Man City, <laughs> Scotland and Burnley. It's great to see you today. Thanks for joining us, Willie. And I'm going to leave you the news that Burnley are promoted back to the Premier League. They've won here by two goals to one. Thanks to Willie Donachie for his help on Clarets Plus. It's finished. Middlesbrough one. Burnley two. Goals from Barnes and from Roberts that come from the spot. But the news that we all wanted tonight, Burnley are back in the Premier League. Take care, everybody. Enjoy the night. I'll see you on Monday. Burnley against Sheffield United, 8 o'clock. Leaving the news, Burnley are back 
in the Premier League.